we're going to solve more problem on implicit differentiation now if you watch my previous video I said in implicit differentiation you have X and Y they are fully involved in such a way that you can't separate X from Y when you have that kind of equation just know it is implicit differentiation you don't need to force you don't need to force the equation you don't need to try to express X in terms of Y to solve it explicitly for instance if I had x squared plus y squared equals 4xy then plus 5 now if you have this kind of question you can see that in this kind of expression x and y are fully involved in such a way that I can't be able to separate them the question says find the y dx now I know that I'm going to solve this problem implicitly now I'm going to solve now in implicit differentiation I have X and Y together so an easy way to do this is we are going to differentiate with respect to X and we'll differentiate with respect to Y each time you differentiate with respect to Y always multiply your result by the Y dx or by Y prime which is the which shows is a derivative now if you look at this, I'm going to differentiate this. If I differentiate this, I'm going to get 2x plus, I'll differentiate with respect to y, I'm going to get 2y dot y prime because I'm differentiating with respect to y. So each time you differentiate with respect to y, you multiply your result by the y dx, which is the same thing as y prime, equal. Then this becomes a product, if you look at that, I'm going to write 4 into so I'm going to solve this with product rule product rule because I have um, I have two function x I have two uh, um, two functions as product x and y so I'm going to tag this as u I'll tag this as v now if you recall the product rule this is the formula um, u dot the v dx plus v dot the u dx now this is u x dot the derivative of y if i differentiate y i'm going to get one now because i'm differentiating with respect to y i'm going to multiply this by y prime plus this represents v y dot i'll differentiate with respect to x if i differentiate x i'm going to get one then i close the bracket the derivative of a constant is zero so therefore in this expression 2x plus 2y dot y prime now which is equals to 4 i'm going to open up the bracket 4xy plus 4y um, 4xy prime sorry plus 4y now this is this and this represent um, this y prime is the same thing as the y is the same thing as the y dx so I'm going to take collect like them so I have 2y dot y prime minus 4xy prime equals 4y I'll take this to the other side minus 2x so I'm going to factor out um, y prime which is my derivative y prime will be um, 2y minus 4x equal 4y minus 2x I'll divide through by this so y prime will be 4y minus 2x over um, 2y minus 4x now I can leave my answer like this or I can factor out what they have in common here they have 2 in common so here will be 2y minus x over this is 2 bracket y minus 2x so this cancel this so y prime so y prime is the y dx so the y dx will be 2y minus x over y minus 2x so this is my derivative using implicit differentiation thanks for watching my video always subscribe on OG's wealth of math god bless you